soldier when I hit you with the crossover. Take the baseline, stop, pull up, and I make smile. When I stick you, the stakes high, I'm taking your rock. Come on, and ain't nobody making it stop. This pressure got the stadium locked. It's exciting when you watch an NBA style clash at the Titans. The handles is quicker than the eyes like lightning. And when you getting dunked on, it's frightening. Believe that, but you need that. If you came to get your ball on, sweating body fluids till they all gone. Got you hurting when I'm seeing you breathe. Mad at me, cause I locked you down with the best D in the league. You couldn't score if I give you a three. Wide open, take you straight to the hoop and leave the baseline smoking. And I'm poking, cause none of y'all can get with me. On a solo fast break, I might bust a 360. Move quickly, cause sweat is better than fame. You might catch me at the three point, testing my aim. I'm yelling and one every time I step in the lane. That's why singers always bringing you the best in the game. on the Sega Sports Network comes to you from the entertainment capital of the world. We're in L.A., California. Hello, everybody. I'm Bob Steele. And with me is Rod West. And thanks for tuning in. Without further hesitation, let's go courtside for the player introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, NBA fans, let's go courtside for the game's starting lineups. At guard, Chris Whitney. Also at guard, Richard Hamilton. Control the opening tip. Switch, 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 switch. Oh, oh. White misses the fadeaway. That shot goes out of business without too much trouble no, from the up, defense's part. Blake Lee, no foul. Releases. O'Neal can't sink the jumper. Whitney puts the first points on the board. He caught them just a bit off guard, Bob, and he manages to get the deuce. 
It's knocked away. The Lakers track it down and get control. Bryant carries the jumper. Jordan inbounds the ball. It's loose. The Wizards recover it. Brown and the fadeaway. Tough matchup, but he caught the D a little off guard. Gets the bucket. Shoots. Bryant from the arc can't get it to fall. Switch, switch. Ball, ball, ball. Hamilton gets the jumper. Man, he can make that shot in his sleep. I love watching this guy shoot. Don't get smoked. Fires. Bryant gets the jumper. Jordan with the inbound. The Wizards bring it up court and are up a deuce. White can't sink the jumper. Although his execution was a little shaky, he still prevents the two. The ball's loose. The Lakers. Frankly, no fouls. The Lakers connect this trip and tie up the score. Brown throws it in. We've got a tie ball game here. <clears throat> White banks in the layup. Good. Bob, that matchup was all in favor for the defense, but they did take advantage of the situation. Two points. The Lakers bring it up court and are two back. Hey, stops the follow through. Jordan inbounds the ball. We've got a tie ball game here. Get it behind you. Brown kisses it off the glass and in. Tough matchup, but he caught the D a little off guard. Gets the bucket. The Lakers bring it up court and are two back. Let's go, let's fire it up, dude. Can the open shot. You know coach isn't happy with that D. They need to come out and contest the outside shooter. Simple as that. You're right, Rod. They got to play tighter than that. Let's go. Releases. With the drive. Right. Banks in the layup. Good. Good. See the ball. O'Neal with the inbound. It's a six-point game. White threw this one out of bounds and turns it over. A little miscommunication on that one. Pass went a little wide on him. Fox inbounds the ball. I got ball, I got Bryant ball. Bryant went out there, gets the bucket, head out to three. The defense, believe it or not, Bob, had the advantage on that one. They just played it wrong, and it cost the top three points. Brown throws it in. Three-point spread on the scoreboard. They get it down low. Drives. Drops it into the low post. Ori is whistled for reaching in. Nice try for the steal, but he drew a little bit too much contact. Brown with the inbound. Clock down to six. Early on. You don't want to let this game get away from you early. The Wizards have the ball in a one-point lead. The shot clock shows five. Shoots. Break, break. Here's the break. break. Play clean, no fouls. I'm open right. Right 
kisses it off the glass and in. O'Neal inbounds the ball. Three points spread on the scoreboard. There's the horn, and at the end of one, it's 16 to 13. Looking at the quarter shooting percentage, there's a pretty big difference between the two teams. Bob, I attribute that to one team being a bit more patient than the other. When you're more patient in your offense, you take higher percentage shots. Fires! Bryant misses the three. Now it may have looked like he wasn't putting enough pressure on his man, but he's a great defensive player, and he came through when it counted. Let's go, work it, work it. The shot clock is at five. He gets it to fall. Brown throws it in. The shot clock shows five. Wizards take it and take a six point lead. O'Neal with the inbound. The Lakers with the ball and they trail by six. Bryant from the arc. That's two from downtown. Sure, he was going to get that shot blocked. Definite advantage to the D with that matchup, but he didn't care. Pulled up, made the shot. The Wizards have it and are up three. White misses the inside shot. Bryant has an opportunity to get his third three of the night this trip down. Bryant drops in his 14th point tonight. Beautiful move to get the deuce. I love watching this guy operate down low. Wizards have the ball in a one-point lead. It's passed inside. O'Neal blocks it, and that's his first block of the game. You can't overlook the way a block can help pump up your team. Gets everybody energized. Jordan, perfect with the fadeaway. Three-point spread on the scoreboard. Ball, ball, ball. Bryant, money from three. He's got nine points from beyond the arc tonight. The defense, believe it or not, Bob, had the advantage on that one. They just played it wrong, and it cost him three points. We've got a tie ball game here. Driving in. Whitney connects and puts them in the lead. Too easy. O'Neal throws it in. Two-point differential between the teams. Trailer, trailer. Releases. He gets another basket, and he's on fire, Rod. He sure is, Bob. You've got to keep getting the hot guy the rock. That's what you need to do to keep winning. One point separating the teams. Defense! 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 Hamilton connects on this one and stops the run. Fox inbounds the ball. You got him. Bryant buries the three-pointer. He's at those fall for him tonight. That was textbook execution, Bob. Nice dish to the open man for the train. Yeah, nobody was even close to him out there, Rod. Nice play. The Wizards bring it up court and are two back. Seven on the shot clock. Fires. Whitney, perfect from the top of the key. O'Neal with the inbound. We've got a tie ball game here. Shoots. Bryant misses the tray. The defense prevails on that one, although they didn't have the impact they thought they would. It was enough. Walker comes back in after sitting on the bench for a while. Haywood looks fresh coming back on the floor. Haywood, frozen in. Jordan buries the jumper. Make it harder on him next time. O'Neal inbounds the ball. A minute 24 to go. Fires. Be smarter about Bryant from the arc can't get it to fall. 
Now it may have looked like he wasn't putting enough pressure on his man, but he's a great defensive player, and he came through when it counted. Releases. He will gets the jumper. O'Neal with the inbound. We've got a four-point ball game. Quick, move your feet, move your feet. Inside, inside. The Lakers couldn't sink it and still are behind by four. 50 seconds remaining. With the drive. The Wizards score again, and that's an 8 nothing run. O'Neal inbounds the ball. We're down to 42 seconds. Hangs up inside and dunks it. Bob, that matchup was all in favor for the defense, but they did take advantage of the situation. Two points. Just 34 seconds left. Haywood missed it just off the left rim. Just 24 seconds left. They pass it underneath. Bryant from the right block, no good. If you like basketball, and of course you do, you have to like a defense like that. Even when they're just a little wobbly, they can still shut down a player of his caliber. Nine seconds to go. Jordan misses the jump shot. Three seconds left. Shoots. O'Neal can't get the buzzer beater to fall. These guys are just making it easy for the defense. They know that's not his shot. They know he's not going to make that shot. They almost don't have to play defense. Too easy. We've reached halftime with the score 33 to 29. Ori throws it in. Bryant misses the wide open shot. He snags the board and he leads the team in rebounds. Great positioning. He knows just where to be for the board. Fires. Here's the break. Right. Hamilton bricks the open shot. Nine times out of ten, that's two points, Bob. Yeah, the defense got bailed out. A huge break there. The Lakers connect and now trail only by a basket. White hit the inbound. The Wizards bring it up court and are up a deuce. Shot clock is at five. It's stolen! Watch out, watch out! He's right. Misses the tray. The defense prevails on that one, although they didn't have the impact they thought they would. Keep it was talking, enough, though. Talking. Shoots. White gets the rebound. Goes quick. Drives. In, and he's their top scorer so far. He's heated up pretty much from the opening tip. Watch out. This could be a huge game for him. We've got a four-point ball game. Bryant takes it in and stops the run. Perfectly executed crossover lead to D out of the picture, setting up a perfect shot. One point separating the team. They're inside. Jordan. Ori inbounds the ball. The Lakers have it and are down by three. Releases. Bryant now has 30 points this game. Just wide open on the outside. And I'll tell you, it's all about fundamentals after that. Set, spot, release, and follow it through. One point separating the teams. Bryant, this trip down, if he gets a three, he'll have a total of seven from beyond the arc. Stolen. Solid screen. They pass it inside. Seven seconds to shoot. Hamilton can't Bryant, sink the jumper. Bryant. They push it up the court. The Lakers can take their first lead in quite a while with a bucket here. Bryant with an ill-advised step on the line, and he's whistled out of bounds. He stepped out of bounds, and now they're going to have to give up possession. You have to know where you are on the court at all times. They work it in. White backs it out. Shoots. Great shot. And these guys are putting on a clinic. As you can see, they're really shooting well. Bob, they are just on tonight. Simple as that. The Lakers have it and are down Close by three. Out on him. Close out on him. Fires. That's White boxes out and grabs the rebound. That's right. 
shoots. Brown now is in double figures. Tough matchup, but he caught the D a little off guard. Gets the bucket. The Lakers take it up court. They're down five. Bryant misses the long two. Throws quick. With the drive, O'Neal bats it away, and that's his second block of the game. You've got to love the projection right there. That's how you play the game. Makes this old coach proud. Bryant scores his 32nd point with the bucket there. You have to be able to play better defense than that. If you expect to stop a sharp shooter like him from draining it, you've got to step it up. Three-point spread on the scoreboard. on the shot clock. Driving in. Jordan backs in the layup. Good. Corey with the inbound. It's a five-point game. Work it. Releases. It's in. And they're having a great day from downtown. You can tell by his release that that shot was going in. Nice stroke. The Wizards bring it up court and are up a deuce. This is the jump shot. They're running the court. The Lakers, with the score of this trip down, can tie it up. White crashes the defensive glass. You can see the D was off its game just a little bit, but still managed to leave no daylight between him and the basket. He's yours, he's yours. With the drive. <laughs> Hamilton kisses it off the glass and in. Ori throws it in. The Lakers with the ball and a four-point deficit. Bryant misses the three. Now it may have looked like he wasn't putting enough pressure on his man, but he's a great defensive player, and he came through when it counted. O'Neal doesn't sink the leaner. Jordan can't get the buzzer beater to fall. I bet you he wishes he had that one back. We've just finished the third quarter. The score, 45 to 41. Lou comes back in after sitting on the bench for a while. Here's the graphic with the scoring breakdown, Rod. Well, pretty even overall for the scoring. It's who takes control here in the fourth quarter is who's going to come away with the win. They get it down low. Lou carries the jumper. Ori inbounds the ball. The Lakers with the ball, and they trail by six. Fires. Bryant again hits from three-point land. That's eight on the night. For sure, he was going to get that shot blocked. Definite advantage to the D with that matchup, but he didn't care. Pulled up, made the shot. Three point spread on the scoreboard. Coming in behind you. Come on, let's go, D. Yo, kick it outside. The clock winds down to six. <laughs> Can't sink the jumper. He's yours. Shoots. <laughs> Bryant bricks the open shot. Definitely on the way down there. That's goaltending. Count the bucket. Hunter to make his first stint off the bench. Alexander in for the first time. Brown with the inbound. The Wizards have the ball at a one-point lead. Watch right, watch right. Go, go. Kobe Bryant gets the rebound. The Lakers can take their first lead in quite a while with a bucket. Yes, there's a scoring machine out there. Right? Got the most points so far for his team, Bob. He's stepping it up. Two point differential between the teams. Clock down to six. Releases. Brown misses the wide open shot. Now you're going to see that shot go in most of the time. Big break for the defense. Fires. Bryant from the arc can't get it to fall. Way to play the boards and to come away with the aggressive defensive rebound. Pick him up. Drops it into the low post. 
Alexander thinks it, but he only has two on the night. Ori inbounds the ball. It's loose. The Wizards touched it last right before it went out of bounds. Walker looks fresh coming back on the floor. Haywood comes back in after sitting on the bench for a while. Fox throws it in. It's knocked away. The Lakers recover it. Give it up, give it up. O'Neal gets the basket, but that's only six points from him. Bobby, I thought they'd close him down, but he got the shot off without too much problem, and he gets the two. It's passed inside. Jordan gets the bucket and the foul. Great shot. And he'll go to the line for one more. He gives them the lead. Walker with the inbound. The Lakers have the ball and are down one. They pass it underneath. Neal reaches the layup. Minute 58 on the game clock. It's one-on-one. -on -one. It's good, and they've been out shooting their opposition pretty handily. They've got the rhythm, Bob, and they are just playing confident, and the shots are falling for them. Just a minute 50 left. O'Neal misses from the paint. We've got a minute 43 left. That matchup was all in favor for the defense, but they didn't take advantage. The Lakers will take a timeout here. Walker will leave the floor. Haywood will come off the floor. A minute 35 to go. Shoots. Jordan gets another rebound, but that's only two from him tonight. With the steal. It's a five-point game. Releases. Corey couldn't get the tip to fall. The D is going to prevail on that matchup every single time. I mean, their block was a little off right there, and he still couldn't make it drop. It's good, and Roddy's really started off on the right foot. It's nice for a guy to be able to come out hot like that. It can really boost his team. Shoots. Bryant connects on this one and stops the run. The defense, believe it or not, Bob, had the advantage on that one. They just played it wrong, and it cost him three points. White inbounds the ball. Double nickel, 55 in the game clock. Bryant gets called for the reach. A shame they had to take the foul, Bob, but they had to stop the clock. Pretty savvy play overall, though. Jordan with the inbound. The clock winds down to six. Take it to the rim, take it to the rim. Fires. Hamilton gets the jumper. Play tight, play tight. O'Neal throws it in. Just 34 seconds left. Bryant misses the tray. The defense prevails on that. No, they didn't have the impact they thought they would. It was enough. Smart foul. They had to do something to stop the clock. He gets the first of two. He gets them both. Ori with the inbound. 26 seconds left. Mark it down. Another three and they're lighting it up from the perimeter. You simply can't leave those guys alone out there or they're just going to keep lighting it up on you. White inbounds the ball. Right. They'll wrap him up. That'll be an intentional foul. They needed to take that foul to shut down the clock for just a little while. It buys them a little breathing room time-wise. That's it. That's it. He gets the first of two. He gets them both. Ori with the inbound. 20 seconds remaining. Be smarter about it. 
Bryant misses the three. Uh, he'll get hit with the intentional foul. Smart foul. They had to do something to stop the clock. One plus to ten. He can't get the first. Bryant <laughs> misses Bright. them both. We're down to 12 seconds. Fires. Bryant. White throws it in. O'Neal will wrap him up. That'll be an intentional foul. A shame they had to take the foul, Bob, but they had to stop the clock. Pretty savvy play overall, though. He can't get the first. Two shots. He misses them both. Six seconds left. Kobe Bryant carries yet another three-pointer. Splashdown. When it rains, it pours. He's incredible from outside. I thought for sure he was going to get that shot. Definitely the advantage for the view of that matchup, but he didn't care. Pulled up, made the shot. Smart foul. They had to do something to stop the clock. He can't get the first. He sinks the single second. The Lakers take their last timeout. Fox with the inbound. In the books, the final score, 66 to 65.